Good morning, everybody. Uh, today is Tuesday morning. It is another dark, rainy day down here in Texas. A lot of water, a lot of flash flooding and stuff. But I'm in. I responded to emails, made the counter offers and that kind of thing. And so now it's time to do packages. So let's get to it. All right. Let's start our day. Yeah, there's what it looks like outside. And I got a big puddle of water right there in front of the shop so you gotta watch it when you go out to the vehicle you'll get splashed but let's start the day with a comic book uh, well, help if I get to the right box there we go it is ROM Space Knight issue number 16 that will ship in a Gemini mailer. Turn the scale on. Alright. Let's tape this into place. And this one was only in a VG condition, very good condition. So, about a 5 out of 10. And this comic book sold for $1.85 plus shipping. And it has been listed since June the 6th of 2019. There we go. And it will ship at the 8 ounce rate. Our next item will go into an 864 box. Alright, and we will need a postcard mailer. It is the Harley Owners Group 2005 jacket patch. Looks like an Indian feather or something all the way across. There we go. These are unused as far as I can tell. And uh, all I do is I put it in a postcard mailer and then I ship it just like I do a postcard. Oh, need a half a sheet of bubble wrap. And then we just lay it on the bubble wrap, fold, or tuck, fold, and tape. That's it. Now this Harley Davidson, like I said, it's a, called like a jacket patch. Uh, sold for eight dollars and eighty-five cents plus shipping, and it has been listed since April the thirteenth of twenty nineteen, and it will ship at the four ounce rate. Alright, now we need to get our clothing cardboard down. And we need to find up here, I think it's this orange shirt right here. Let's see. It should be new, yeah, Izod, new tags, linen cottons. Yep. Yeah. So it's linen cotton blend, it is an Izod, size medium. New with tags. Feels really nice and light. If it was my size, I would have kept it. But, unfortunately, I'm a little bigger. So, I'll just fold this up. Make it look nice. And then we use an eBay poly mailer. Get one out here. Thank you. 
Okay. Push all the air out and one piece of tape. And the Izod shirt here sold for $15.38 with free shipping. It's been listed since December the 21st of last year, 2020. And it will ship at the 8 ounce rate. Next, we have a DVD. So we'll go in an 864 box. We do need half a piece of bubble wrap. Let's go over here. There it is. Before Sunrise with Ethan Hawke and Julie Delpy. It is new and sealed. Now we just put it right on in there. And this one... It's one of those wider cases. I need a uh, small piece of bubble wrap. There we go. That case was just a little bit too wide for the big bubble wrap. With this DVD... Sold for $8.75 with free media mail shipping. And it was listed yesterday, uh, May the 17th of 2021. And it will ship at the 8 ounce rate as well. We have one of the die cast cars that's up here on the top. And a, another Spawn comic book. Okay, must be my last one then. First, we have the Spawn, issue 302. This is the second print. And supposedly... Come on. Right here. There's a color variant. Um, I think it. this is yellow, and it's supposed to be like orange or red or something. But, at any rate, it's this is in uh, low grade. It's only a good to good plus. Let me get it bagged and boarded. And this is my last one of these. And it will ship in a Gemini mailer. down into place okay and this even being a low grade sold for three dollars and fifteen cents plus shipping and it has only been listed since April the 16th of this year, 2021. So it took, what, right? A little over 30 days. And it will ship. It's right at 8, so I'm going to ship at the 12 ounce rate. Alright, now with this Hot Wheel TRV Speed 12. It is a purple car. 118th scale and there again it is in the box i think both ends are still sealed but the box is in rough shape so oh, i keep wanting to go there for bubble wrap we need three sheets of bubble wrap um, let's 
think that's number four. All right. This will go in a 16, 12, 8 eBay branded box. Just fold the ends down like you're doing a Christmas gift or something. Let's get the 16, 12, 8 box. have a lot of tape left on this tape roll, so even less than I thought. Knew we were getting close to the end. Get the 1612-8 box all taped up. Let's see how this one fits. It's a pretty nice fit. I think we can use the uh, extra sheet of bubble wrap here. To hold it in place. I don't think this is going to move all that much. Too sure if this one will go FedEx or Priority. I won't know until I get to the label part. Some of these surprise me and end up going Priority. Now this car sold for $36.74 $36 with free shipping. And it has been listed since... March the 18th of this year, 2021, and it will ship at the three pound, 15 ounce rate. Now we have another shirt, and it was listed the same day as the eyes odd, so it should be here in the front. That one is it. Yeah, this one right here is it. It's that Daniel Creme, Cremox, but let me get the this one is a size extra large. It is a short sleeve. But we'll just fold this one up and put it in a eBay poly mailer. Nice light shirt. No, don't give it that. That fabric is soft and light. I think it's cotton though. Oh, let me put this on up. And again, this one was new with tags. Bought from the same estate sale. And this shirt sold for $18.75 with free shipping. And was also, like I said, listed December 21st of last year, 2020. And it will also ship at the 8-ounce rate. Our next item is a belt buckle. And we will ship that in an 864 box. When the 
need a sheet of bubble wrap. And let's go get the belt buckle. Let me turn the light on here. And I have my belt buckles in this little box over here. There you go. Now you can see. And it's that one right there. Alright. Carpenters Built America. It has some tools. It is, you know, embossed. And, uh, made in 1983, Siskiyou Buckle Company. So, it's pretty nice. It's got some weight to it. it. Took this a while to sell, but, you know, it's still at yard sales and stuff. If I find a nice butt, butt buckle like this that's, you know, a dollar or two or less, I pick them up. And that will need an additional half a sheet of bubble wrap because that buckle is pretty heavy. I don't want it flopping around, bouncing around the box. I don't think it would get damaged, but I don't know. And this belt buckle sold for $18 plus shipping. And it has been listed since July the 18th of 2016. And it will ship at the 12 ounce rate. Now we have a customer that purchased three comic books. They bought the, I'm not sure if it's, okay, three issue miniseries. They bought them all so they can read the whole thing. It's Swords of the Sharpay, issue one, issue two, and issue three. These will ship first class, so we will put them in a Golden Age bag. Yeah, I think. There we go. Take that down. These will ship in a Gemini mailer. Now we can tape them into place. For Swords of the Sharpay issues one, two, and three, the customer paid four dollars and twenty cents plus shipping, and these were all listed on the same day, July twenty-fourth of twenty nineteen. And they will ship at the fifteen ounce rate. Our next item will ship in a 1086 eBay branded box. All right, let's get a sheet of bubble wrap to roll and one more for the padding all right and it is a dvd set that i listed a little bit ago from a tv show you might remember the pretender i have seasons one 
two, three, and four, which was the complete deal. And then they also had two movies, TV movies. And this by itself is like $60, $80 just for the movie one. So this was a good sale. I remember his name, I think, was Jared. I, I vaguely remember the show, but it's pretty good. Good, And like I said, the, the movie special there is a really good purchase if you ever find that out while you're out and about. All right, another roll bubble. And I did clean all these discs before I listed them. And what was kind of crappy about that is they're double-sided discs. So those are always a little bit tougher to clean than single-sided ones. All right, no movement. And like I said, seasons one through four is the complete series of the TV show. And those get pricier the higher up. You know, season one isn't all that much but then two three and four they just keep getting better as it goes along as price wise this set sold for 160 dollars with free shipping it's been listed since february the first of this year 2021 and it will ship at the two pound 15 ounce rate and what i'll do since it was that expensive i will ship this priority mail and they will need to sign for it so that catches us up to the minute on packages and so now i'll show you what i'll be doing i will continue to photograph and then list new and sealed dvds so i will see you when we get another sale all right it is after lunch and i have dropped off fedex and we have a couple more orders first is a comic book set right there all right this is cable and x-force issue number one through 19 it is the complete set so we will match them up i guess i'll let you see them as I match them. And these uh, are part of the storage unit uh, comic collection I bought. And I just put these as good to very good, which is kind of reader condition. Uh, but like I said, this is the whole set, 1 through 19. Put those in a tie back envelope. And make a nice tight brick out of it. way two sheets of bubble wrap that little bubble wrap might be getting close enough to where I could put it on the wall where I keep trying to go so I just wrap these up in the two sheets of bubble wrap get a regional rate a box
There we go. Bows out the box just a little bit. Not much. But just enough so that it's very tight and secure when it's all sealed up. And this is, like I said, a flat rate, regional rate A box. And I'm nowhere near the weight limit. So we don't even have to worry about weighing it. The next item is a DVD. So we will ship that in an 864 box. Oh, while well, I'm taping this one up, the X-Force cable set there sold for $24.50 plus shipping. And it had been listed since February the 20th, or no, February the 17th of last year, 2020. And now for the DVD, I was kind of surprised this one sold as quick as it did. Uh, well, no, oh, there it is. Steven Seagal, Half Past Dead, with J Rule. We need half a sheet of bubble wrap. And this is another one of the DVDs I listed yesterday. And this was one of the lowest ones. It almost did not make my cutoff to list. Because usually I don't list them for less than like $7.15 or so. But I was like, eh, let me take a chance. You know, maybe an action movie will sell. And it did. It, it sold in less than 24 hours. This one sold for $6.45 with free media mail shipping. And like I said, it was just listed yesterday, May the 17th of 2021. And it will ship at the 8 ounce rate. Alright, we just got paid on a Spawn comic book. Shoot, $2.99. Two ninety-eight. yep. Alright. It's the McFarland cover. It's the Spider-Man homage cover. And this is Spawn issue $2.99. And we will ship this in a Gemini mailer. Tape it down into place. I've been listing and photographing DVDs all day during the time between packages. And I'm surprised. I mean, they're new and sealed DVDs. And... Uh, Several of them have been, you know, like 18 to 20 bucks or so, which I'm kind of surprised about. I thought most DVDs were pretty cheap, you know, 7 to 10 dollar range, and this is all with free shipping. But, uh, yeah, I think I've listed uh, about 35 so far today, and photographs and whatnot. Alright, the Spawn 299 comic book here sold for $9.75 plus shipping. It's been listed since March the 31st of this year, 2021, and will ship at the 12 ounce rate. And next, we have one of the DVDs. Now, this DVD I listed yesterday. Here we go War of the Roses with Kathleen Turner, Michael Douglas, and Danny DeVito. Again, it is new and sealed. It's going in an 864 box. And this DVD sold for $12.75 plus free media mail shipping. And like I said, I just listed it yesterday, May 17th of 2021, and it will ship at the 8-ounce rate. Now we have a customer that bought three comic books. We need a uh, Master of Kung Fu. 106. I think, well I know one of these is in the Hulk section. 
I think they both are, but I'm not sure. No, it looks like the other one is in the marble section. Let me make sure I don't have a cutting edge section before we go do that. No, I do not. Alright, so yeah, it must be in the marble section. Well, unless it's in the Hulk, not incredible, but just regular. Hulk. Yep, that's it. Alright. So this one is Cutting Edge, the Hulk number one. Then we have Incredible Hulk, issue 389. And Master of Kung Fu, number 106. Now we'll put these into a Golden Age bag. These will ship first class. Okay, the camera battery died. Uh, but for those three comic books, I got $5.25 plus shipping. And the oldest one was the Master of Kung Fu that had been listed since November the 15th of 2017. And now we have these red women's Justin cowboy boots. Uh, they fit in a 12, 10, 8 eBay branded box. I was trying to get let the battery charge up a bit. They put one of those air pocket mailers right there to prevent any movement. And I used uh, bubble wrap to make sure the boots don't rub up against each other or anything so that there'd be no wear marks. And for these boots... I just accepted an offer of $20 plus shipping, and they have been listed since April the 18th of 2019. And now the buyer emailed right away, and I need to change the address a bit, so I'll need to make sure I do that. And these will ship at the 2 pound, 15 ounce rate. Alright, now we have an order that's going to take a little minute. This is, let me step back so you can hopefully see it, the USS Massachusetts BB-59 Battleship. It is a 1 and 350th scale model kit made by Trumpeter. It has been opened, but as you can see, uh, it looks like the contents are new and sealed. And so I already folded two sheets of bubble wrap to put in the box so all that stays where it should and this is a pretty long model kit box and everything um, let's see here yeah, it's just under 28 inches in length and uh, when I got the model kits I have two that are kind of like this my wife had just ordered some bookshelves and so I kept the boxes the bookshelves came in too because this fits almost exactly as far as the height part goes. It is a tight, tight fit. Oh, come on. I've already cut this box down and my, I just bumped into something. All right, let me cut the bottom of the box open. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. And it was a piece of cardboard that had been in there from the bookshelves. Alright. Now let me tape this side back down or back up or however you want to call it. 
Alright, I think these two will hold while we actually get it all going. I already cut the box down a little bit. As you can see, the box originally came up to here. I already cut this part all down. Now my plan is... Come on, I'm going to fold right. To cut this, or to fold the side flap all the way over so it will protect the box the actual model box I think I want to do this. This, I'm quite certain, just because of the size, will go FedEx. Alright. Now, I could probably just tape this as it is, and it'd be okay. But I'm going to go ahead and fold these two over as well. And I've got some stickers to remove. You know, from where it was shipped to our house. But that's enough. I don't know, not sure how much battery life I have. All right. So the Battleship model kit sold for $78.10 plus shipping. And it's been listed since March the 29th of this year, 2021. And it'll ship at the five pound rate, four pounds, 15 ounces. Now we have a Christmas ornament. That will be in the back here. There we go. St. Nick. A Hallmark keepsake ornament. Uh, from 2006. It will ship in an 864 box. a sheet of bubble wrap cut it in half wrap this up in half there we go Now, on this ornament, I took a best offer, and I kind of messed up. I uh, did not realize this one was with free shipping. So, I accepted an offer of $5.50 with free shipping. It's been listed since November the 4th of last year, 2020, and it will ship at the 8-ounce rate. And so, with the free shipping and fees and everything, I'm probably making a dollar or less on this ornament. But, at least it's out of the inventory and gone. Alright, that is going to do it for me today. Uh, all done up packages, I think. The power, uh, there's a big power station right across the street. And something blew over there. And so I've been without power for about 20-25 minutes. I got power back on right now, but I went ahead and shut everything off. I'm going to head home, uh, edit a video or two. And uh, just kind of rest up. And I'll come back and get at it tomorrow. All the power guys are still across the street, so I'm thinking the power will go on and off again a little bit later. Uh, but I did packages up today, and then during all the downtime, I would photograph, uh, price, and list DVDs. And I think I got 45 to 60, I think probably 45 uh, DVDs listed today. And I've already got... Uh, 
a stack that I've already priced and I'll list first thing tomorrow. I've got a stack that I have photographed and I'm working on another stack. So I hope you all have a good evening and we will see you again tomorrow. Bye bye.